So after one false start, here we are for the real thing. Why would you say that? Why would you let anyone know that? This is funny. It's not funny. I, We've I been sitting here for an desert. hour, and and good old Nate's just been wasting our time. Okay, well, anyway, putting different Samuel sizes of power. pills up his butt. Fucking listen to me. What? Samuel gave us a new power, which is to activate these things. Ride through it with your horse. By charging at them, like so. Right. Uh, that is pretty cool, yeah. That's pretty badass, even if it's just literally another key item. Mm hmm. It's a cool looking one, though. I mean, it's yeah, good. Yeah, I mean, it's just kind of they... dumb how it does literally nothing except that. Just yeah, like but, the, uh, but, but you don't really realize it and you don't really care because it's cool. As long Most, as it looks yeah, this, cool and is, is cool, I don't really care that something is essentially just a key. If there's one thing Darksiders can do well, it's smoke and mirrors bullshit. Yeah, like, um, I, I mean, it's not a, a thing to really heavily hold against the game, but like, yeah, totally. Skyward Sword, like, you get all those keys to prove yourself, you, it doesn't look cool. Like, you don't yeah, do... at least this game has you, like, ride across a badass ghost bridge. Yeah, and if you remember, pretty much the only one I liked was, uh, I liked that the earrings would glow when you went into the fire area. Yeah. Because it was an actual effect that they paid attention to, and that was kinda neat. It seems like we're at a dead end here. That was a really shitty camera angle. Uh, uh oh. We got the little ghoulies. I hope we just get grabbed by them instead of having to fight we them. We did. Well, yeah, that's oh. literally what happened. Okay. Oh, so now we are in the iron canopy. And we aren't having a very good time. God dang it. Does oh, this man. Nice be here? You'll want to protect this younger war. <laughs> that's pretty funny. <laughs> so we are now in the fourth dungeon. Which is some spooky spider shit. Hope you don't have arachnophobia, because this is not the game for you if you do. God, I hope you just get like some wood through your arm and shit. I hope you just break like several bones and moan a lot. You know what really bothered me about that? What? It, was, it wasn't even that that stuff like that happened. It was that they took it to such a ridiculous extreme. It was like literally Murphy's Law of the game. Yeah. Yeah, no, that game, that game is the worst possible things happening to a character, and it's really bad. Every single time. Everything yep. you do breaks. Uh-huh. It, it's basically, it feels like watching um, Final Destination, where yeah, seriously. everything is a fucking Rube Goldberg of, of misfortune and killing you. Yeah. Referring to uh, Tomb Raider, obviously, for Tomb those Raider who did not get the you'll want to protect joke. Mm -hmm. But that's kind of old news at this point, so I mean... It is, but it's why. also not out yet, so... That's true, so it's still relevant. Mm -hmm. Which is kind of funny, it's been 10% uh, off on Steam for a long time. Because well, you, like can, pre you can pre-order pre -order it, yeah. You can pre-order it for like a long time now, but it's still like not actually out. Which is funny to me. I see. Hmm. And that's we'll use a... that chronosphere to get past that grody spider. I like those chronospheres. Yeah, they're okay. I like that I mean, it's they're... it's a thing that they put in the game that isn't actually an item that you have. It's it's a new yeah. mechanic that you're using, but without the you know need for an item to do it. It's not like hook shot pads or something. Yeah. So I always some of these are called they're called fallen angels. Ah, okay. I, you know, I thought there was something like that. They seem yeah, it seems fallen. It's the logical conclusion, yeah. Yeah. Okay. But it's been I... a while since I've done this, admittedly, so I don't always remember the exact way to go, but I do have the vague idea. Okay. Uh oh. Tomb Raider, everybody. I mean, Darksiders. Oh everybody. no! And now the glass in the plane is breaking, and we're gonna fall through uh -oh. the waterfall. How zany and unfortunate. Uh oh, but now a boulder runs us over. Of course, we have to fight a bunch of angels. I like the stuff you can do with the trimmer gloves, though. Where you just, like, spike dudes with it. With the glove thing? Yeah. Yeah. 
You can just get up somebody, on somebody and just slam dunk them with that. Yeah, like so. Oh, there's another one. Hey, buddy. <laughs> That's so fun! Yeah. It'd be cool if you could just get him in a loop of that. Yeah, just bounce him over and over. We just call it, that. We call dude. it the dunks loop. Oh, man. That sounds... Stone's big dunk decision. Joke. Okay. Joke made. Completely incoherent. But... Mission accomplished. Stone's big dunk decision is always like the funniest shit in the world to me. It's and, a like, pretty funny don't, thing. Probably don't really know what it's from. There was um the Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom was coming out. Ultimate MVC three that is. There were some patch notes up on the wow, Japanese that's, Capcom site. That gun does shit damage. I actually upgraded it between videos, so it does a little more. It's still pretty shit. It, it, like, fires, like, twice as fast now or something. Oh, nice. Anyway, so there were patch notes for Ultimate MVC 3 when it was coming out on the Japanese Capcom site. And they weren't in English, so Google translated them. And the one for, like, Super Scrolls, Meteor Smash, Attack, referred to it as Stone's Big Dunk Decision. <laughs> so that's that joke explained. There was some pretty other good, like, there's some other pretty good ones, too. Like, there was stuff about, uh... Storm having a good wind and a bad wind. Fair wind and foul wind. Yeah, I foul the wind. Exact terms. One. Foul wind. Ew. <laughs> Which really just sounds like Storm's ripping a nasty fart. Oh, I hate finding these spiders. Fuck it. Getting the siphon. Oh man, if you hate fighting spiders, you should really Hulk out against them. Yes, I'm gonna Hulk out against some tiny ass spiders. <laughs> That sounds like an well, excellent I don't know about you, idea. but whenever I see like an actual spider, especially like a cockroach or something instead in my house, like I just flip. I just go ape I, shit. I hulk out and just fucking lose it. I just lose my goddamn mind. Except by hulking out, I mean I just kind of screech and, and kick at it and then get a shoe and try well, to Well, it depends on how big the spider is. And then never use oh, that can, shoe again. Oh, it turns again. out I can just like kill these, spi these spiders like this. Okay. That solves problems. Come here. Oh, they have an insta kill on them before you even have yeah. to. Oh, okay. Get off the damn wall, spider. I didn't see a Thank prompt. you. What? <laughs> That's great. See, I was trying to open the chest and I just stomped the damn spider and stuff. Yeah. Funny how that works. Okay, let's see if we can make the jump back up here. Nope. Okay. Yeah, I don't think you can make that jump. See, I thought we could, but that explains why it wasn't going that way. I don't. I didn't remember that. Yeah, the weight. Yeah. You can the, probably make the nest of eggs. Get the hell out! God. Oh my god! Do they keep? Dang. Do they have some like unlimited spawn points around here, or what? I'm starting to think so. Come here. Cause you've killed a hell of a them. lot of baby spiders. I wonder if I can like. Uh, I'm not sure how to get up there now. Hmm. Mm. Consider climbing. Oh, yeah, actually I see what to do. Parkour. I wasn't thinking. Gotta go even higher. There we go. Puzzle solved. My mistake. Mm -hmm. I'm a fool. I'm an idiot, etc. Please kill me. Sorry, that's a little harsh. A little bit, yeah. Okay, now we just tip the weight. Now we just play the waiting fuck, game. Fuck my life, I don't know how to get up there. Okay. Again, I'm literally an idiot. Hang on. There's some souls down here. You know what? Do you want to just like not bother with that? I don't think it's mandatory. Okay. Actually, wait. I think it's something good. So. Well, ah, make up your mind. This is stupid. 
This is stupid. Can I climb on this? No, I can't. Okay, we're leaving. Fuck this. Way to way to know what you're doing. It's been enough damn time in this room. If, it come, if it's important, I'll come back for it. Shit. So. No, no, okay. Oh my god. What are you doing? That was embarrassing. Found a switch. Okay, maybe the switch will weigh down the... God, I'm an idiot. Yeah, you are. That's a time switch. <laughs> Fuck my life. Why didn't I just do that first? Oh, man. Puzzle solving. If there's one thing I'm good at, it's solving puzzles. Just kidding, I'm fucking terrible at it. Alright, hey, I got a puzzle for you. What? What? How did I fall off? Nice! God damn it. So, hey, here's a puzzle for you. Okay. Two trains are moving at 300 miles per hour in opposite directions. One leaves at 7 p.m., one leaves at 8 p.m., and, uh, also you can't get the, you can't put the big flapjacks on top of the little ones, and if you leave oh, so a wolf alone with the chicken, then, uh, it eats it. Oh god. God damn it. Can I use a hit coin? I can do this in two moves. Ah. Uh. Okay, so that was important and necessary, turns out. Good thing we didn't leave. Yeah, alright, we got that. God, I'm the dumbest motherfucker alive. How do I not remember that puzzle at all? I... you don't seem to have, like, a really super good long-term memory. I don't have a very good short-term memory. I was memory. just saying. Oh man, I think you need a RAM just... upgrade. That's memory. That's a computer joke. Ah, yes. I use computers, so I understand this joke. I also post on computers.com. And my favorite webcomic is XKCD. Man, I'm gonna tell this joke to my computer friends. They'll love it. Yeah. I'm gonna post this on Facebook. Man, nobody on Facebook knows these jokes. They'll fucking... Everybody they on Facebook really posts about how they're they're going to Vegas. Be on your Facebook. Mine's, full, mine's all full of people that, like, talk about how nerdy they are and post nothing but... Minecraft bullshit. That's pretty cool. I like Minecraft. Minecraft's pretty much the haven for nerds, I think. God damn it, get out of here. Why am I not just stomping these bugs? There, I don't damn. know. They give you health if you stomp them anyway, so. Yeah, so why don't you just stomp stomp a damn bug? Just like stomp in real life. A damn bug. Okay, well, that's how you kill these nasty big tick spider things. You shoot them? You gotta knock him off. I can, uh... God damn it, no, get back here. Fuck. You failing Idiot. to reach its weak point? <sighs> yeah, you were. This is... bad. Alright. Well... You know, you, you gotta learn, you know? You gotta break a few eggs. Do I? Not really that big a fan of eggs, to be honest. What's your favorite preparation method for eggs? Um, mine is scrambled. Mine is broken. I just love broken eggs. Are you Come failing back, to idiots. hit him still? What am I doing wrong? You gotta get on his belly. You probably Can gotta I? bomb him or something, man. You don't even know what you're doing. Is this your first time playing this game? Are you new? Yeah. Look, he's literally telling you how to solve this damn room now. Don't make me call you again. God, the watcher you are is such he's just such a prick. You're not my mom. He literally said don't make me call you again. You are not my mom, the watcher. Well, he, God, he just so did it. He nagging. called you again. You made him do it. You'd 
better come when I call. Just get off my ass, Watcher. Just crawl down out of my fucking ass. Well, he's probably trying to show like... you something important and you're like not letting him. Turns out I wasn't supposed to kill that yet. Huh. Yeah, yes, maybe, that. you know, you should have just followed him. Yeah, but I had to knock it off to be able to use that ledge. Okay. Well, I figured it out. Thanks, Watcher. Uh-oh. Never seen one of these guys before. Uh-oh. Let's spend three minutes trying to figure out how to beat him. Nah, it's just another, like... These are just regular mooks. For Is he gonna time. jump on our sword whenever we try to thrust at him? No, that would be pretty cool, though. Bet these guys are real jealous of you. Why do you say that? Is they're green. Is they're green? Yeah. That's a little racist, don't you think? Why did this even have to be about race? Because well, you're the even, one they're just out their color. Flames. That's not even a race. Oh, so they all just like... No, never mind, I'm doing this joke. Yeah, it's a bad joke, they're not even a race. There's, How do you know? It's just fire. Yes. Well, anyway, these are basically just like regular skeletons, but tougher. They even have the same execution animation. They even have the same pair of jeans. No, the skeletons don't have jeans. These aren't zombies, they're skeletons. You don't know shit about fuck, asshole. <laughs> well, okay, that's not something I'm gonna deny, but... You don't know your tits from your ass. That I don't. That I do not. Ooh. What's going on in here? Oh, Party. it's another one of these things we haven't seen in a while. Oh, man, it's a rave. Fucking rave's going on. You bring the, uh, you bring the LSD? You no, bring, sorry. Did you bring the, uh, XKCD? Yes, please look at my stupid hat. Please look at my fucking programming joke. Please love me. God, I'm so superior for his programming joke, but also I'm lonely. You can tell that I'm lonely from the crushing loneliness in all of my comics. <laughs> Perhaps were I not to alienate all of my fellow mankind, I would not be so lonely. Alas, this is ah, the shit. curse of the autist. <laughs> Such is my life of shit. So what are we doing here? Gotta push this Oh, he's thing. gonna kill himself by grabbing it and the thing's gonna explode on him. No, not again. No? Nope. That looks like a bomb on top of it. It is, but we're not going to use it in that particular way. I understand. Do you? Punch it, though. No. Because it was already on the thing. So now that's on that elevator, we just go right here. Bring it up. Can we punch it yet? No. Hmm. So nice. Then bring it over here. You think if we punch it, it'll go all that way? No, it won't. It'll fall off. Especially if so. you're gonna punch that weakly. What if I do it like? Yeah. There you go, that's a much better pipe. Huh. I thought you killed that thing already. Fuck. It doesn't die. Oh. You can only stun it, which is irritating. It is pretty irritating, and also it is stupid. Yes, it is incredibly stupid. But at least you attack really fast. Ah, bomb! Okay, now we're good. Handled it. Alright. 
we can bring this up here. Throw it on this wall. Wait for it to blow up. And we're good. You require Ooh, cool. the red key to operate the red door. No. Thank God. Oh, that's one of these things we haven't seen in a while. I miss that style of, uh... Lay, like dungeon and whatever layouts. What you first mean, like person, first case? person shooter. Yeah, I miss that that objective. Uh, in every first person shooter, being get the red key, get the blue key, get the yellow key, and then man, they don't make them like that anymore. No, huh? they don't. I can't think of a single a shooter reason. recently where you have to get the the colored keys to open the doors. Gee, to progress. I wonder why. I don't know, man. That was a classic. Uh, Form of progression. Uh, Literally yeah, do the same was... thing, but in a bunch of different levels. Game design. I always forget that the air dash can be used to attack. God dang it. What's up? Dude's blocking all my attacks. Tell me tell me what's frustrating you. I he was blocking all my attacks. I think it goes deeper than that. What's the matter? No, that's here? all that's about all there was to it. Whoa, 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 we haven't seen one of these before. No, we haven't. It's like a dude that we have seen, except uh, tougher. He's got mighty fists full of lava. God damn. His belly uh -oh. looks like a furnace. Oh, he grabbed me. I bet you could make some good taco meat in Why there. Why would you do that? Right in his belly. Taco meat, you say? Mm-hmm. How would you make taco meat in a furnace? Um, if you were Don't making... Don't say it's authentic. Why would I say that? Oh, I guess I, I understand know. the joke. I think I get it. I think. Seems like something you would say. Some kind of bullshit doesn't make any sense. Are you Not saying that I, I use non sequitur humor? No, no, laughs? I don't mean. I, I was specifically saying not like a non sequitur, but just something that sounds like it would almost make sense until you really think about it and then you realize how bullshit it is. What I'm saying is a blatant falsehood. I bet you. Giants and dwarves have to make taco meat in front of us. Mash the button. I was. I was mashing as hard, literally as hard as I could. You are pitiful. I know. Where are your Marty, Marty? Where are your Marty party skills, huh? There we go. Yeah. Whoa, okay. I wasn't expecting that to go. Take him way. to the Marty party. Just dropped that sucker. Why does this guy have so much health? God damn! He's hard. He's full of taco right. meat. Fuck, he's crazy, man. He's all tacoed up and ready Do and ready. Do you even know how many Jack in the Box 69 cent tacos this guy's had? Never had Jack in the Box. I know, but he's fueled as fuck on those. Yeah. Just raging. Yeah, he is. You got some money. We've got. Uh, I feel like instead of just giving you, you a ton of. Um, Wait, fuck. A ton of like ghostly skulls that fly at you, and like the more and you get indicates like you know, the more money. It, it would I think it would be better if you actually just collected skulls and like. Uh, you'd get like, you know, regular skulls are worth one, uh, but then you get like bronze skulls and, and silver skulls and a gold skull that's worth 200 that'd be really neat if they did that 300 only in skyward sword mm, yeah i guess i thought you i thought that was the joke you were going for well the no it was a zelda joke in general 
Uh, and in every other that's Zelda, the Zelda game relevant. in every other Zelda, it's 200 rupees. Okay. And silvers are 100. Yeah. And purples are 50. You don't see a lot of purples. No, you don't see too many. And I don't think there are any purples in Skyward Sword. Now, I think, I think it. there. Were, I think there were a fair amount in like Majora's Mask. There were a lot of purples and a lot of silvers. Oh yeah. The only purples I remember are all from Majora's Mask. I don't even remember any in Wind Waker. No. no. You should go on Zelda Wiki or something right now and look up purple rupees. See what games they have appeared in. Oh man, okay. Not like I'm doing anything interesting. I I'm drink the perp spiders. by the pound. You don't measure liquids in pounds. I know, but that's literally a quote from a song. Yeah, but that doesn't make any sense. I'm just letting you know. Oh fuck. Just at least know how to fucking measure your liquids, okay? Shit. Oh, okay. Hey, here's the boss door. Oh wait, no, it's some we I guess it's we smoke burp by the I mean I don't even know what it is. I can't tell I if don't it's think, Do you measure Do you measure weed? A whole pound of weed. Got weed pounds. Man, I'm so I'm so I'm putting on weight from all this weed I'm that I'm smoking. From all this weed. Oh, dude, that's some. That must be what medicinal marijuana is really about. Ah! Uh, it, it tomb raided me again. Um. Okay, so the thing about that boss door is that to open it, we have to kill all those, uh, chuffy spiders. Neat. You know the ones? Yep. But to do that, we're gonna need something. And that something is right here. Purple rupees are in Ocarina, Majora, Wind Waker, and Twilight Princess. Makes sense. I don't remember in Wind Waker though. There's probably some. Yeah. So now we have the hook shot. Yo, hook it's literally me in the that. hook shot. They call it the abyssal chain, but it's the hook shot. And we can rip the dude's carapace off and just. Wow, that's straight up just the hook shot. Yeah. Ah. Did you like crank the difficulty at some point so things got more health than they really need? No, I'm playing on normal. Ew. What's up with it? Oh nice. Yeah. Crawl inside so, that mofo. Yeah. And Keep one of the spiders on the that winter. door disappears. Oh, so we so have to we kill four of those to open the boss door? Correct. And that means now that we've uh, gotten the dungeon item. We can go pretty much anywhere in this dungeon we want. Can we hook shot to the webs? Mm, not sure, actually. I'm gonna find out. I'll see if you can hook shot on a creep. Mm. Okay, but check us out. These things are the hook shot points. Yep. Yes, yeah, that's right. You can hook, up, hook shot on a creep. Neat. Oops. Everything in this game is so much faster. You know, hook shot, right? you just you're just there, you zip. And you don't even have to target for it, you can just go like that. But I fucked it up, so Nice. So I guess you can't see? really just go like that. You just like it's all yeah, willy nilly. See? No, so you can. Alright, fine, whatever. This is cool because it's also like a grappling hook too. It's not just the hook shot. Yeah. With that chronosphere there, we can get to this item. Which Majestic. I believe is the next key. Yes, it is the key. Amazing. Yes, fantastic. Still kind of tripping over keys literally just being blades that you shove into eyeballs. 
Yeah, it's, it's pretty gross. That's real fucked up, Darksiders. What are we I doing? Remember how to get out. I'm trying to remember how to get out of here. Do I use the gun? That's right, yes. Yeah. Neat. That was easy. Yeah. Man, those keys are super fucked, though. That's gross. As someone who was kind of paranoid about the idea of getting my eyes fucked up by something. Yo, man, I, oh. have, I have, like, nightly dreams of somebody just sticking shit in my eyes. I don't. Like, the thing that fucks me up bigger than anything in any, like, horror movie is that scene in, um... You know, Clockwork Orange? Oh, I didn't watch that did. movie. I don't like indie films. Never mind then. Sorry. <laughs> Just forget it. I'll, I'll, okay. I'm sure it was good. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure you, uh, I'm sure you actually think that. What? That, that it was good? Yeah. I'm I would sure know you I haven't actually seen believe it. that. God damn it. <laughs> so what? Somebody stabs out eyeballs? I feel like we went the wrong way or something here. It does kind of seem like you went the wrong ass way. Oh no, this is the right way. There's just some money over there that I don't care about. Never mind. Fuck it. So there are these points where you don't swing from them. This game is really snappy though, and that's exactly what I want from it. Yeah. Let's take a look at our map. Doesn't really tell me much to be honest. Actually, wait. Yeah, no, okay. That's the wrong way. Do you remember how, like, every few years a Spider Man game is made? And it's like, yeah. it's just a coin flip over whether or not the game's good. God, yeah! I hate that! Like, you got Spider Man 2. Which good. Was amazing. And then you've got, like, Spider Man 3. Which was not so good. But then you had, like,. Remember like Web of Shadows? Shadows? Was amazing. Web of Shadows, Shadows was, was so good. good. Then there was the the Shattered Shattered Dimensions or whatever one. I don't know if that was any good. Which was okay. Uh from my understanding. I haven't played that one. And then there was the Amazing Spider Man, which I'm not actually sure that the game was good. I haven't heard anything really good about I've it. I've I've heard literally nothing about it. But I did see the DLC out. where uh you literally play as uh you know, the one guy from the comic machines. Stanley? Oh, yeah, you mean the one the where guy. he yells Excelsior a lot? No, what? Yeah, apparently he yells Excelsior a shitload in that DLC. Does he really? Wow, okay. Yeah, which is fucking you, hilarious. It, it is kind of, you play as, you play as him, Stan Lee, and uh, he has Spider-Man cool powers, but he's just Stan Lee, like he's not wearing like a costume or anything. And one of the lines <laughs> that he said, like he'll exclaim while fighting, is like, oh, I'm gonna tweet about this. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually really like legitimately funny. It 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 actually made me want to purchase that game like when it's like yeah. five dollars so I can grab that game in the I'm, DLC I'm, I'm and be Stanley. Wow, that's really good. Uh, Stanley's a cool guy. Like I think it's even funnier in the fact that he's not like wearing a costume. He's, he's just, just Stan. Yeah. He's just Stanley who can inexplicably shoot spider webs and shit. Like just because why not, right? It's just graceful Stanley kicking people's asses and shooting webs. Makes no fucking sense. Oh man, I'm gonna tweet about this. this is a really good <laughs> battle cry. <laughs> it really, honestly is. Uh, so two spiders to go. Yup. I'm just gonna spam. I'll tell you an easier way to beat these guys. Spam that? No, whenever Please. you pull... I mean, yeah, that's a cheapo idiot way. Whenever you uh, pull their shell Cheap. off, crawl underneath it and they can't hurt you. That's a good idea. Why didn't I think of that? Yeah, and then you just walk around like a, like a turtle. Like a, like a mobile tank. Okay, yeah, I, can, I like that idea. Aren't most tanks kind of mobile anyway? No, uh, no. Still. Some tanks are in fact stationary. If you've ever played oh. StarCraft, you would know. Yeah, but those aren't permanently stationary. 
Yeah, but they go into stationary mode and they literally just can't move. Okay. And they yeah, take forever to transform. But they do a shitload of damage. They do, yeah, with lots of splash damage. Good range. Yeah. That grosses me out every time I see Crawl it. Crawl into it. Roll around. What, Stay into warm. Its nasty use brain it, cavity? Yeah, use it as like a sleeping bag. Ew. Impress your friends. I don't know if impress is the word. Uh, I mean, would, I would you be impressed? I would be impressed, yeah, if you slay like this this weird giant thick thing and like had its like cavity split open like that. Don't I don't know just what say kind of it's cavity. Yeah, because I don't know what kind of cavity that is. It's not really a stomach cavity. It was more like it's just a cavity. At least I didn't say hole. At least I didn't say anything about you tearing its hole open. Just, its hole is in shreds. I have decimated its hole. Disgusting. Not you, the hole. Naturally. This, where's the last one? Find it. Find it for me now. It's the first one we saw. We I, thought we, I thought we just killed that one. I don't know where we are. They all uh, look the okay. same to me. Hello. Forgot that was there. Hello, beautiful. Hi. Hi. What is it? Ah, oh, yeah. I found yeah. a, a wrath shard, yeah. There are probably heart pieces in here that you missed. Oh, it's right here. Glad I went up there, though. Yeah, if there are, we'll do a big, like, roundup thing. Probably won't get all the wrath shards because I barely even use my wrath powers enough to justify it because. I mean, who cares? But I will find all the heart pieces. I mean, life stone shards. Life, life things, but... And you told me like two days ago that you were getting all the wrath shards. Did I? I thought yeah, I said you I didn't want to. No, you said because it, there's only like 15, 16 or something. No, there's only 16. Yeah, so whatever, there's not many. Shut up. Get off my ass. Okay. Maybe oh, you would oh. use them more if you had more of them. Yeah. No, it's just like all the powers you get for it are kind of useless. Except for the spike one, it does lots of damage. The guys yeah, but it sucks anyway. <laughs> you suck, it's good, What is man. that? Do you see the spinning carapace off in the distance? Yeah. It's just, that's, what is it doing? It's some, something else crawled into it and it's fucking breakdancing. That's what you could have done if you'd listen to me. Okay, let's try the immolation thing. Wow, oh, that sure was useful. It was, you set it on okay, fire. I was, being I was being disingenuous because I barely had any wrath. I'm just oh. being an asshole. Well you did you did set it on fire and that was pretty cool. It's pretty pretty bitchin'. Hella bitchin'. Is that thing still spinning? No, yes. it stopped, I think. It's just going wild over there. I think it despawned.